Hello everyone, how's it going today? I hope you're having a great day today. This is the 3rd of February, 2021 on Wednesday. So every Wednesdays, I talk about my own strategy called KTS, K's Trading Strategy. Um, I am a Japanese full-time forex trader in Tokyo, Japan. And I look at the charts, multiple time frames. So I am a day to swing trader. So my main uh, time frame is either daily or four. And I confirm it in mid time frames, which are one hour or 30 minute chart. And when it comes to taking trades, I look at either five or 15 minute chart for entry confirmations. So today's topic is about um, how to confirm the uptrend by Ichimoku or downtrend by Ichimoku. And um, I would like to introduce one of the emails uh, so that the, uh, you can also clear this question. So before starting here, just a quick disclaimer. This information is basically based on my own and uh, experience knowledge. So when you take trace, please do with your own risk. So let me introduce one of the emails. Um, I have the attachment here. So hold on, let's see. All right, so here's a screenshot of uh, the email that I got from Marvin. Thank you for the email. And let me introduce this email. So he says, Dear K, according to KTS, if Kumo's up, Kijun Sen is up, and Chikou spun above the candles, price above Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, and the Kumo, but Tenkan Sen below the Kijun Sen, See the screenshot of daily chart, New Zealand CAD. Would you confirm a trend on that pair or not? I think this is a good question. So let me answer this question on this today's video session. So um, here is a chart and he was exactly seeing the chart like over here on this day. So in this case, you can see that the, um, so here is a New Zealand CAD pair and this is the chart back in, uh, 27 28th of January so let me zoom in here and you can see that the, the Kumo is trending up now we see the Senkospan B is up A is flat at the moment but um, the um, the Kijun Sen is flat and it's Chikospan above the candles but uh, let me go back a bit more until we see Kijun Sen moving up so what about this one now okay so I think this is the chart that he was sending exactly yep so sorry this was the uh the chart on the 25th of january and if you can see here then uh you can clearly find that the uh, the kumo senkospan b is a lower part and senkospan a is upper part of the kumo when it's the up kumo here so you can see that the b is up a is up and also Kijun Sen, the green one is called Kijun Sen. And you can see that the Kijun Sen is upwards now. And Chikou Span is also above the candles. This is also above the candles. But the thing is that the Tenkan Sen, the blue line, is called the Tenkan Sen. And Tenkan Sen did cross and this is below this Kijun Sen. So he asks, Tenkan Sen below Kijun Sen, would you confirm a trend on that pair or not? So what is your answer to this question? So right now we see Kumo up, Kijun Sen up, Chikou Span above the, above the candles, but the Tenkan Sen below the Kijun Sen, and would you confirm this is uptrend or not? So my answer to this question is that this is not the uptrend. This might become fake uptrend and the market might reverse backwards from here. And the reason is because, yes, as he mentions, uh, this Tenkan Sen is below the Kijun Sen. So, yes, according to my strategy, uh, KTS, uh, the way I look at the chart and confirm the uptrend is based on this Kumo in Senkospan BA and Kijun Sen angles. So, in the past lives and videos, I say, if Kumo's up, either that means either B or A up, and Kijun Sen up, then this is the uptrend, so I look at the lower time frames to confirm this uptrend. But this is ex exception actually. If Tenkan Sen is below the Kijun Sen, then this is not the uptrend. So we have to wait until the Tenkan Sen overlap with the Kijun Sen as the market goes up this way. We have to wait for the overlap, and then 
we can look at the lower time frames to look for the buy chance. But at the moment, because the Tenkan Sen is technically below the Kijun Sen, the market might go downwards from here. So this is a very good point that he pointed out this one. So yeah, if uh, let me cancel the candlesticks and this is becoming more clear, we see this green Tenkan, sorry, green Kijun Sen is um, uptrending at the moment, but the blue Tenkan Sen is now below the Kijun Sen. So we have to wait until this Tenkan Sen uh, overlap or gold cross the Kijun Sen, then we can look for the buy chance. And so, um, so let's see what's happening in the market right now. So this is a chart back in uh, 25th of January. So let's see what's happening right now. So let me cancel this back uh, bar replay and let me forward it to the current chart. So here, what do you see here? So now we see Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen gold crossing exactly today. There is a Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen gold cross and also the Kumo Senko Span B flat but Senko Span A is moving up this way. Senko Span A is moving up and also Chiko Span is above the candles too. So exactly from today, the 3rd of February, I will continue to look for buy chance in lower time frames because now this is a stable uptrend so we can expect the market goes up this way and breaks previous high upwards this way too. So, yeah, when you see, although you see Kumo up and Kijun Sen up, we have to look at the Tenkan Sen location. If Tenkan Sen is below the Kijun Sen, then we have to wait for the gold cross or overlap to look at the lower time frames to look for the buy chance. And same as the bearish trend. If you see Tenkan Sen above the Kijun Sen, when it's bearish, when the Kumo's bearish and Kijun Sen bearish, then you have to wait until the Tenkan Sen overlap or comes below the Kijun Sen and go down to lower time frames to look for the selling edge. Otherwise, the market goes upwards and you may get lost cut if you take tra take in trace in this kind of condition. So now I would say that it's safe to look for the buying edge. So let me look at the, let's go to the one hour chart or 30. So now as per my strategy, um, hold on, let me move this one. As per my strategy, this is uptrending. So now we see, oops, hold on, hold on let me bring this, uh, KT's PDF. Oh, by the way, this is available for free. So if you come to the link below description and uh, come to my KTS free download website, you can get this free PDF. And also, if you're interested to learn the depth of my strategy, including a strategy, taking trades, trading edges, stop loss, break even, and trade profit, and also risk management and trading journals hands on then this is the one that you are interested. So I have the GTS Global Trading School and that's coming up on this April. So if you are also interested on this um, extensive uh, lecture or the 101 membership group, then uh, please also write me email so that I can uh, put you on the members list. So anyways, uh, so right now as per my strategy, I can see that the daily chart is uptrending. So I will go to either 1 or 30 and if one of these time frames are trending. So let's go to 1 hour chart. So here is an 1 hour chart and what do you see here? In 1, we see Kumo flat, Kijun Sen flat. So although the Tenkan Sen above the Kijun Sen and Chikou Span above the candles because Kumo flat and Kijun Sen flat, this is not a good timing to look for buy chance. And I think the same is true in 30 minute chart. Oh, sorry, 30 minute chart shows uptrending now. So we see Kumo up and Kijun Sen up and Chikou Span is technically above the candles. But now this is very close to the candles, so I would wait until 
uh, that call span clearly comes above these candles to look for buy. So if the market grows a bit, a bit more like this way, then I will look for the buy chance. But uh, there is a good chance the market goes up this way because we see Kumo Senko Span B, Senko Span A up, sorry, Senko Span A up, and the Kijun Sen also moving up this way. So then I look at the 515 to capture exactly three confirmations to enter the buy. But I would say that this is a great buying chance at the moment. So once again, this is also all becomes possible because now we see Tenkan Sen becomes above the Kijun Sen on the daily chart. And I think this is a great question to pick. So that's why um, I picked this uh, question here today. So once again, if you're interested uh, and if you have any questions, please put your question on the comment box below or you can send me an email with these attached charts so that I can answer to a question on these public lives so that uh, it helps you and it helps other traders as I answer to these questions. So if you use, if you can use the Ichimoku five lines correctly by, by using it like this way, then your analysis, you can save time to capture the trend direction. You can look at the price action to capture the trend direction, but um, if you if you want to be more confident, then um, I recommend you to use Ichimoku Kinko Hyo like this way. And hopefully at a glance, you can capture which way the market is trending. So and now this is uptrending because Kumo up and there is a Tenkan Kijun Gold Cross above the Kumo, right? Tenkan Sen becomes above the Kijun Sen and Chikou Span above the candles so that you can get ready to look for buy chance in lower time frames. So that was my topic for today. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you liked it, please press a good button and make sure to subscribe and click the bell button so that you get notified as I do these videos and lives every day. So tomorrow on Thursday and Friday, there will be a live stream exactly at the same time as today. So I hope to see you on tomorrow's live stream. So, yep. Today it's been retracing, the market is retracing, so no trades for me. Uh, I am only looking at the USDJPY and CAGJPY because these are trending. Uh, USDJPY is trending upwards and also CAGJPY is also trending up on the daily chart. So these are the two pairs that I'm watching right now. But um, hopefully um, we see we can catch some trends uh, today, tomorrow. Or the day after so yeah i will see you on the next live stream on t thursday or friday so i hope you have a great great day today and catch some trends and please stay safe stay healthy and stay gold bye for now matane thank you matane means see you in japanese so matane